Boys and girls watching, it is activity time and I brought a friend today. Kitty. Say, it's Kitty and my friend's name is Katie Kitten. Say hi, Katie Kitten. Hi, Katie Kitten. Katie Kitten wants to come home to your house today. So Katie Kitten, we're going to make some more of you. We're gonna make some more of your friends. So when we have a puppet, we can do all kinds of things with it. We can make her sing, we can make her talk, you can do all kinds of things with a puppet. You could tell a story about Katie Kitten and Amber Lamb and Button Bear, and you could use your puppet Katie Kitten to tell a story. So we're gonna do this puppet together. It's gonna be so much fun. But first we have some cutting out to do, and then we will glue our pieces together. So it's kind of like a puzzle, but we have to glue the pieces in the right spot, and we're gonna do that together today. Class stand, boys and girls watching, go ahead and prepare for our paper. Go ahead and sit down. Take out only this piece right here. Let's get this paper ready first. I'm gonna put Katie right back up here. She's gonna watch us as we do our paper today. Get out your paper. I'm gonna grab mine. And as you see, we have Katie's face. And this is going to be, what do you think this is? Tongue. Our tongue, this is how she's gonna talk, how she gets to lick up her yummy water that she likes to drink and the things that she likes to eat and how we're going to make her talk. So we're gonna need our face and our tongue. Now do you see Katie Kitten has some ears. We don't want to cut her ears off. So when I cut, I'm gonna cut around the thick black lines my babies are going to go in the big hole. My mom, my daddy's in the small hole. My mommy's on top. And watch, I'm gonna cut around my tongue. Whoops, there goes Katie. My tongue first, like this. And then I'll have my tongue piece right here. And that's gonna go on my name tag because that's what I cut out first. So I'm gonna put that right there. And then I'm gonna cut out Katie's face. Now I wanna be very careful. I don't wanna cut off her nose. I don't wanna cut off her whiskers. I definitely don't wanna cut off her ears. She won't be able to hear. So I have to go very carefully around her hair. Again, around her ears, just like this. And do it very carefully as I cut around Katie Kitten's face. And there it is. And then there's my trash and the trash we're gonna make into a snowball again. You're going to roll it up into a big snowball and then Katie Kitten's face will go right on top of your tongue, Katie Kitten's tongue, on your name tag, just like that. All right, go ahead and pick up your scissors. Boys and girls watching, you should have your scissors. Go ahead and pick them up. Remember, you put them in the hand that you write with. So if you're right-handed, you put them in your right hand. If you're left-handed, you put them in your left hand. Go ahead and start cutting out the tongue of Katie Kitten first. Cut right around that black line. Oh, good. Lauren's off to a great start. Oh, Connor, you got your fingers in the wrong holes. Let's turn it around this way. It'll be easier. There you go, now you got it. See, isn't that easier? Angelina. Good, good, Carter. Wow, Johanna has her first piece cut. Good job, she has her tongue cut out, so does Joseph. Way to go, Joseph. Go. Make sure you're cutting, don't cut off the ears. Don't cut Katie Kitten's ears off. Cut right around the tongue and right around those ears. You don't wanna cut either one of them off. Good job, let's put that right here. How you doing boys and girls watching? You got your tongue cut out already? Working on Katie Kitten's face? Good, don't forget, leave her ears on. Good. Nice job. Mm -hmm. Keep working on it. You're doing great. Let's check over here. How are we doing? Open, shut, open, shut. Good. Coming around the corner there. Good. Good job. 
Remember to take your trash, roll it up in a ball, stick it right inside of your trash can. Nice work. I think everybody's almost done cutting out Katie Kitten's face. I'm going to show you her paws next. We're going to cut out the paws in just a second. Good. Nice work. I like it. Joseph has his nice and neat right here, right on his name tag, ready to go. Boys and girls watching, you have your pieces ready for the next step? Awesome. Good job. Good job, Connor. He's ready to go as well. Way to go. Nice step. All right, let me show you this step. Now we have one that has her little hands. Now do you see her hands have some, it looks like her mittens, like she's wearing some mittens on her paws. So we do not want to cut her mittens off, then her hands will get cold. So as we cut around those black lines, we're not going to cut her mittens off. We're going to keep her mittens right on there and just cut around the black lines just like this. See how her mittens are still on? I still have her mittens. So if you've already cut out her face and her tongue and they're neatly on your name tag, you may take out her paws, take out her arms with her paws, and we're going to cut out her arms with those red mittens. I'm going to cut right around. We don't want to cut her, her thumb off. Our fingers inside are her mittens. Kind of reminds me of our three little kitten song. The three little kittens put on their mittens to eat some what? Christmas pie. I don't know about you, but I couldn't put mittens on and try to eat. No, no. As you cut out your paws, put them right on top of Katie's face so you don't lose them. Go ahead and start cutting. Okay, make sure you tuck your tummies in. Keep right inside of your table so you keep all your things together. How fun. We're doing great. Good job, Carter. He's got his all cut out. Nice work. Where's your mittens at? Oh, now you're getting to your mittens. Okay, where's your tongue at? Is it right here? I think it's right here. There you go. Leave yours right there. Good. Look at this nice stack right here. She's ready to work hard on her puppet. I like it. Very fun. What story we could tell with Katie Kitten? We could tell about Amberland. What what could we say? What would Katie Kitten tell us? You don't know. Maybe she could tell about the time she got stuck in a tree, and Button Bear climbed up and got her. We you could tell that story. You could. Okay, we're doing great. Joseph's ready. Bethany's ready. Nice work, guys. Boys and girls watching, how are you doing? Do you have all your pieces ready to go? Good. All right, Lauren, let me tuck you in so you can get all your pieces ready. If you're done cutting all your pieces, you can put your scissors in your bucket. Wow, look at table three, sharp. Go ahead and put your scissors in the bucket. Okay, take your paper, make a snowball. And go ahead and start passing in your scissors. Nice work. 
Nice job. Go ahead and sit down. All right, table one, you can take out your lunch bag. Boys and girls watching in their desk, they have their lunch bag. That's what we're going to use to make our puppet. So your on-site teacher has one for you. So you can get that ready. The bucket's coming. Angelina, tuck your toes into the table, please. All the way. Take your bag out. Put it right on top of your table. Do not do anything with your pieces yet. I'm going to show you what we're going to do. Do not put your hand inside of it either because we want to keep it nice and flat for just a minute. You'll have a chance to play with your puppet. Do not put your hand in there. Mm -mm. Just leave it down just like this and wait patiently, please. Thank you. All right, let's see. Table one is ready. Let's see how table three looks. Good. All right, boys and girls watching, you have your stuff ready to go? All right, let's look right here. On our lunch bag, you can see how it has like a little flap. See that flap right there? That's where we're going to put the tongue in there. So check right now that you can find your flap. That's like the little flap of your bag. Okay, and then put it down where you can use it. So you're gonna put it down just like this so that you can use it. So this part right here is gonna go towards your name tag. This is where you can see it. The first thing we're going to do is we're gonna take Katie Kitten's tongue. Find Katie Kitten's tongue. Find her tongue. You got it. Good, turn it over so you see the white part. Put it down flat on the table. Not on your bag, on the table. Now, everybody has some glue. Boys and girls watching, maybe you have a glue stick or your teacher's gonna help you with your glue, or you might have your very own glue. We have our very own glue in a little cup. So I'm gonna take my Peter pointer, I'm gonna stick my hand down in there. Oh, your eyes should be on me and your hands in your lap so you can see. Good, thank you, that was quick obedience. And I'm gonna get lots of paint, or glue. See that glue on my finger? And I am going to put lots of glue on my tongue, the white part of my tongue. Now, I don't know if you can even see that because it's white on white, but you might be able to see that. See how I'm spreading the glue? I only stuck my finger in the glue one time. And then watch what I'm going to do. I'm not gonna use Peter Pointer now because he has lots of glue. I'm gonna use my other fingers. I'm gonna take it and I'm gonna put it under the flap, just like this. Now, let's look at the tongue. Do you see how there's a wide part of the tongue? and then it kind of goes down into almost like a point. The wide part is at the top, the point comes down towards you. Go ahead and turn, get your glue. You've already turned your tongue over. If you haven't, then you need to follow directions and turn your tongue over on the white side. Put, you put your finger all the way down inside. Get your glue. Get lots of it on there. Spread it around. Spread it right around, all the way around it. And then stick it right under that flap, the tongue. Stick it right under the tongue. Good. Then turn your, open up your bag. Let me show you. You're gonna open up your bag. Maybe if I do it sideways, you can see. Open up your bag and stick it right there. Okay. Oh, you got lots of glue on it, so you can turn yours over and stick it inside of where the flap is. Good job. Let's see over here. Okay, you got lots of glue on yours too. I think it'll stick. Turn it over and stick it right inside. Nice work. Good job. All right, take Katie Kitten's face, turn that over, and put it on your table. Take Katie Kitten's face, turn it over so you see the white side. I'm gonna do the same thing. Stick your finger inside, get some glue. You're going to rub it all over like this. Get it all on there. You might have to stick your hand in there two times. Now you don't have to try to paint like you're trying to paint and cover the whole thing. You just have to get it in different spots so that it'll stick. Don't try to get, to get all the glue all over it. Then you're gonna take Katie Kitten's face 
and watch the top part, the part that you flipped up, put it back down and stick Katie Kitchen's face on top. Just like that. Now she's going to have some of her ears sticking up like this. See that? So let me show you. So go ahead now and stick Katie Kitten to your bag, to the top part. So then that way, watch, now you can make her talk. Just like that. So fun. Good job. All right. Now, what do we have left? Yeah. Her hand, her paws, don't we? We have our paws with her mittens on. Now, I want to show you something. Do you see how the side of your bag, it's kind of open a little bit, it will open up? That's where we're going to stick her paws, just like that. Could be tricky, but I think you can do it. Watch Mrs. Stewart. I'm going to take one of my paws. Now, I don't need to put glue over here on the part that is pink up here. We're not going to put glue right there. Oakley, are you watching? We're not going to put pink glue on the pink part. Just down here on this part. So watch Mrs. Stewart. I'm going to put some glue on my finger. I'm just putting it on this part right here on one side. I'm putting the glue down here. See that? I didn't put it up here. I only put it down here. And then watch. I'm going to open up the side of my bag a little bit. Looks like it almost looks like two bags. See that? And I'm going to stick it right in there. And there's my one hand or my one paw. Go ahead and do that now. I'm going to show you one more time. We're going to get glue. Not on the paw. Don't put glue on the paw. It's at the bottom part. And then I stick it on this side where I open up the flap a little bit and stick her hands inside. And now Katie Kitten is ready to play. Isn't that fun? Go ahead and do that now with your paws. Boys and girls watching, how are you coming? You got your Katie Kitten face glued? Your tongue is glued in there? Almost finished, good. Okay, that's a lot of glue. I think you're done. Here we go. See, and you open up the flap and you stick it in. Now do it on this one. Yep, you did it. You got it, Joseph, good. Mm-hmm, good job. I like that hard work. Good. Let's see how we're doing over here. Yes, you did it. Good job. Stick it right inside. Let's move it over just a little bit. Okay. Now you don't have to put that much glue. Just put it right here. Okay. There you go. You got it. Good. Stick it in there. Good. Oh, so fun. Look at these Katie Kittens. I love it. And then Katie Kitten will be able to tell her story today. You could go home and tell the story. Maybe you could tell that story about when Katie Kitten got stuck in the tree. This project was a lot of fun. I hope, boys and girls watching, that you follow directions, that your Katie Kitten is ready to sing or tell a story.